Well, hello, welcome back to Chellington Valley. I'm Mighty Mike. Last episode, I took off a load of grass bales. And so I worked on getting this field mowed and baled. I've already taken uh, some bales to sell. I've made $17,332. And uh, here's the remainder of the bales. See how much I end up with. All right. So I'm uh, right at $41,000 now. A little bit of a uh, breathing room in the bank account there. My next task now that I have that grass picked up is I want to uh, go ahead and plow those grass fields. Uh, they both need plowing. It's not going to make a huge improvement in yield uh, as far as grass is concerned. But if I do decide to put crops there, uh, it, it will be beneficial. So I'm going to go ahead and do that. This plow only only needs 90 horsepower, but I did use it with the smaller tractor, which has 95, and it really struggled with it. So I'm just going to hook it here to the bigger tractor. We'll ease over to the field here and get it going. Oh, wrong way. And there's a crash. Cut across this field here. Just gonna run around the edge real quick, create a border. And then I'll let the worker go at it. The next thing that I need to figure out is how to get some lime out. Probably need to go pick up some kind of spreader. Once I get the worker going, I'll check into what's available, make a decision.
This thing is a little bit on the slow side, but it's doing the trick. Okay, I'm going to let the worker have it. Now I'm headed down to the uh, shop here. Picked up a, a fertilizer spreader, a lime fertilizer spreader. And supposedly it's light enough that I can pick up. So I figured I'd just throw it in the back of the truck here. And strap it in and take it back. This is it here, it's the Vicon, Vicon PS 1654. And it does appear I can pick it up. How about that? Although it's, <laughs> it is uh, quite large for the truck there. Let's see if it'll strap in. No, I don't think so. Nope. I had to drive carefully. It seems like it's riding okay. So far. Well, I've managed to make it all the way back without it falling out. I'll set it out here by the uh, refill station. get a hernia for lifting that. Ooh, my truck just died. Ooh. Hey, I'm going to use this tractor down here. Which is my only choice. Should have picked up a pressure washer while I was down, but I don't know where I would have put it. Okay, I'm going to go see how, much, how far this will get me. As you can see, the uh, plow got over into this field. I had to... Uh, luckily, I caught it and was able to uh, stop it. Whoa, that's a... Wow, that's a spread. Okay. And it is ripping through this line. Holy cow. Man, 
and I'm out. Oh my gosh. Okay, well let me uh let me make a couple runs, it looks like. Okay, this is my third trip here to the field. I don't know if I'm gonna make it, doesn't look like it. Looks like it's gonna take one more trip. Jeez, one more. Little squirt. And I'm out. Alright, back to the farm again. And there's the fence post down. Okay, so this field is done as far as lime. And that guy's done plowing that field, so I think I should be able to run right over there and start on the lime there. I do need to wait on this tractor on the front. This is a little bit much for for this tractor without a weight. Yeah, it looks like you finished up. Very good. Oh, we missed a spot. Let me run and go fix that real quick. Two spots. Well, this is getting a little bit old. I need to figure something else out. It just doesn't have enough capacity. And, you know, certainly a field like that. Jeez. Alright, well let me see what I can do here. What I can come up with. Well, I come up with a solution. Bought one of the uh, service trailers full of lime, brought it down, and I just got back to the field with the spreader. I filled it up at the yard and brought it back down. So, hopefully, I can get these fields done. If nothing else, the ones that are over here, the furthest away from the farm, as they get closer. Oh, as I get closer to the farm, the commute back and forth won't be as bad. But this will have to be a temp. Oh, I'm out already. Jeez, it'll have to be a temporary lime spreader. I think for fertilizer it'll work okay. But this is a. Uh, it's going through the lime just. Far too fast. I have the plow going over on that field. I'll rock through that. It actually, I don't know if it even needed to be plowed. No, it didn't. Oh well. Uh, I don't have a cultivator, so I guess plowing's as good as anything. And why is my spreader stopped filling up? Well, 
Well, let me get this lime out. Try to take care of this field. And then get going on that field over there. See where I end up. Okay, so I just finished up this field. I have three fields done. And I just walked over my tractor. And I did start, while this guy was finishing the plowing, I did start on the uh, grass field across the way. I'm going to uh, go ahead and fill up here. And I'm almost out of lime. This actually may end it. Use it up. Okay. So we'll head over to the grass field. I've got about half of it done. So it was, it's pretty close to the... Uh, actually, there's a lime cell point on the property. So it's pretty close. I can run back and forth and finish up this field. Definitely will have to come up with something in the future. That just holds a little bit more capacity. Guys, I appreciate you watching this episode. If you found it entertaining, please give me a like. And if you haven't done so already, go ahead and subscribe to the channel. And as always, thanks for watching. We'll see you next time. Okay.